Hey everybody, Gene here again. Today I'm anchored, well actually for this coronavirus quarantine thing, I'm over here at Bahia Falsa, which is about seven miles north of La Paz, uh, Baja California. It's a nice place, there's not much here. You can see it's just a dirt road. There's a little beach down there. You can see the bay, there's the bay, looking at the whole bay. You can see the bay out there. You can see a little fox, which is the blue boat right down there in the foreground. That's a little fox. My 20, uh, my 39 foot Freya. And uh, the bay is very productive. We landed the dinghy right down there by those Pangueros house. You can see that. And uh, no waves, no nothing. It's just easy to come ashore. Drag it up on the shore, step on the dry land. And, um, and, uh, there's just not much to do here. We're just kind of eating, drinking. The fishing is wonderful. We got sea bass, we got tuna, we caught uh, trigger fish, and it seems like every time you throw a hook in, you grab something. So if you use the smaller hooks, they'll swallow it. The trigger fish with the small mouth, and you can get a lot of fish. For every four bites I get with the small hooks, I pull out three fish. If I go to the bigger hooks, the hook about the size of my pinky, which is quite large. I'm going to use an 8 pound test by the way, it's very light tackle and I'm using my lake bait caster line because I like to play with the fish. But if you use the bigger hooks, you get sea bass because they have a bigger mouth and it hooks them by the lip. But it doesn't work for trigger fish, so if you want to limit your catch to sea bass or tuna, use the big hooks. I've been putting bait on it, bait works great. Uh, I use fish, if I, don't use, if I don't have fish I start with bread to the first fish then it becomes a sacrificial fish, amen, and it becomes bait for all the others. Um, a raw fish out because you get fish every day constantly. Uh, as far as the virus goes, there's not much going on high in town. The people are wearing masks. We do when we're in town. We're out here remotely, so there's no need for masks. And there's no shortages. There's plenty of toilet paper, but there's no paper wipes. The, the sanitary wipes. But uh, neat places like this. Cactus. I don't know what this is. Some kind of cactus. You can put in the comments below what kind of cactus that is. I have no idea. And um, it's been great. You know, I like making my videos short, three to five minutes, so you can just click on it, watch it, and get off. I kind of like those. So hopefully I'll keep it down. Hope you liked my dinghy uh, presentation earlier. It's on there. It's about the comparison. There's a lot more to be said about dinghies, but uh, we can do it in comments or something like that. Like I said, my preference is the aluminum ones. So, one more closing shot of the beautiful Bahia Falsa. Those are all my fellow boaters. There's a lot of these people where you get to know them because they're all here together and you're all just hanging out. And <clears throat> that's pretty much it. Let me go ahead and say goodbye to everybody. To y'all, I'll keep you posted as I cruise uh, Baja California. Thank you very much for watching.